we had stuff we had to talk about. Yeah. That's why. Exactly. Couldn't wait another day. I couldn't wait another day. I'm dying inside. I know. And I want to get Dying to it. I want to get right up to it. So let's go ahead and get All this right. started. You ready? Rack let's do up. it. Welcome back to another episode of Diego and Sam Know Nothing. Where we can film anywhere, anytime, any place. That's right. We can do it. That's right. We can do it. We can make it happen. It's a little different. Yeah, that's I'm, okay. I'm high. That's okay. Not, I know. I'm not high. But we're uh, we're high definitely the, higher up. I'm high on the table is what I meant. Yes. You're you're very high. I feel like I need to move this here. Yeah. That's, All right. Good. All right, guys. It's okay. It's okay. We're going to be fine. We're gonna yeah, be, we got we're going to be just fine. Uh, we got a quick one today. Anyways. Yeah. Yeah, it's At good. That's what we say at first. But we, but did, we did need to... We need to discuss some things, and we're a we little, had to get this up. We couldn't wait till Monday. We're a little no, we could not. I just we wanted to make sure we got it because while well, I'm very fresh on some of this, very very yeah, fresh I'm, as you I'm can, still as pretty you fresh. Know. Yeah, but you're like two hours fresh. I'm like two yeah. hours fresh, which and is so, good, which is helpful for me. And but before we get into the thing that I'm two hours fresh on, I know we're a little late to the game on this one. I wish we could have gotten this out, yeah. but I wanted to talk to you about the boys. Okay. Okay. And so the boys ended last week, right? I know. First Friday without the boys. Sad I know. Day. So sad yesterday, day. no boys. But I I actually didn't get to it right away. Okay. I think because I knew it was the end, I was like, I don't mind if I wait a little bit. Right? Yeah. I was like, I'm oh, not going to. I feel that. I'm going to wait. Mm-hmm. But I got around to it and, again, just did not disappoint. It was it's- so good. It was such a good ending. It's great. And it and again, it ends on a point where you're like, what's going to happen next yeah. season? Yeah. Are you kidding me? There's yeah. so much in the up in the air still. Mm-hmm. I couldn't believe it. I really thought we were going to we were going to tie some loose ends here. No. And oh my gosh, there's more loose ends than ever. I mean, the the, the writers on this oh, show yeah. phenomenal. And and it's phenomenal. It's and I don't think they're like trying. They're like, oh, we got to keep right. things open and we got to keep characters. I just think they're that good that they're like, oh, this is the story we want to tell. And they can just like they don't have to think about it. That's a really good I think point. Is interesting. Yeah, it's a really good point because the show has never felt like it's been forced. No, it has never felt oh, like we're doing great things. Show. Because- <laughs> great show. But it, it, <clears throat> it has never felt <clears throat> like, oh, we have to keep Homelander alive because this he's the money happen. maker, right? Yeah, like yeah. it's never felt like that at all. No, it has only felt like he is alive because of his character. Spoiler, the characters are doing. Spoiler this. warning too. Oh yeah, super spoiler warning for all the that, things. That's so. Let's take a sidebar real quick. Okay. At what point do you stop giving spoiler warnings? At what point are you like, <laughs> hey, this is? Is it a week, you know a year, a month? Like, what is the point? Because I see a lot of reviewers that are like talking about a movie from 1998, and they're like, "Spoiler alert!" I'm like, "No, no you don't have uh, to give enough, that warning. Enough. If you haven't seen Titanic, it's the thing is then here's... <laughs> if you don't know how Titanic ends, get out of here. Like, why are you? I'm, even I'm not here? trying to preserve your feelings, but and and I get why people do because they're like, let them experience that for themselves. Maybe they're not big into movies. Blah blah blah. Don't care." Yeah, but Sorry, the, especially if it's twenty years. Old. I agree. I mean, especially I if it's absolutely years old. agree that there's a timeline, right? Yeah, but so, there, yeah, there has to be, and, and I definitely agree. But here's my other thought on that, because I know exactly what you're saying, and I know people get upset. Mm-hmm. We we are a review show. Yeah. Okay. So there's nothing that we are going to talk about that we haven't seen, mm. and I would say for us, just. Always assume it's a spoiler. <laughs> yes, right? es- especially where we are in the game. Right. So yeah. we don't have a million subscribers. No, no. Where we can review the same thing three times. Right. We do a, a non-spoiler, um, and then a spoiler. We're, right. And we're, then a th- like we just talk. We're talking right. about a topic one time. We're, but and we're but we'll always do the courtesy of like, hey, yeah, we'll put it in the say, title, like, the thumbnail, I, whatever. I it usually is. say oh, spoiler 100%. review, yeah. right? But, but what's the timeline? I, I, dude, I, the thing is, you and I are always reviewing something after it comes out. Yeah, and it's already been out. There's right. people that drop reviews before exactly. episodes come and out. And I could see where you might be extra cautious for something like that. Okay, let's maybe put oh, the spoiler a little bit more up front. Spoilers in the thumbnail? Oh, yeah. That drives you have me a crazy. million subscribers and you're putting spoilers in the thumbnail? Oh, yeah. They should be banned. 
our, our our motto or our thing that we live by is we're not professionals. No, we're, we're not. not. We're just we're too drunk drunkies on a, <laughs> a Saturday night. So we're not professionals. Two people having a good time. But like, we would never put an image, never in a thumbnail, never that spoils. Like it's crazy. It is anyway. absolutely insane. But I, I, well, like a week. But we for, are. But but again, like my point is we are a review show. Yeah. If you catch our video after something has come out, assume it's a spoiler review. Yeah. Okay. And if that's not the case, then a week is the thing is I'm like a weekend, dude. I'm like if the movie like came by out Thursday, Thursday by Monday, yeah. I don't think I have to put that spoiler warning up anymore. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like I really don't. It yeah. is out for most of the people that wanted to watch that movie watched it. And if you're a big enough fan, you'll you you've already, already saw it. Seen you it. already saw it. You've already seen it. You saw yeah. it opening night or the opening weekend. Yeah. But then, and then we do Disney Plus reviews, and I'm like, no, they come out, and you can watch them at any point. Yeah. And so I am reviewing the we're reviewing the boys that came, that finished last Friday. We're good. Yeah. We are it's, good. It's been seven days. We don't need to so put up seven days. A week. We could do a seven day we'll say. grace period, if yeah. you will. But anyways, like, Black Noir died. <laughs> that, is that what you were like? That that that's where I was going. Black Noir got his guts ripped out. So there were there were there were two things in the <laughs> show in the season finale that I actually did not. Uh, I wish didn't happen, um, which was Black Noir dying. Not because I think the show made a mistake. I was just I'm, I was just like, man, I really no, wish. But again, how well did it fit that? Yeah, like, yeah, hey, yeah. You betrayed me. You get to die like everybody else does. And I really enjoyed the Black Noir. Well, I really want to see uh, him some more. Cartoon. Right, exactly. Yeah. I, d- I didn't want him to die, yeah. which is the bummer, which is like a very Game of Thrones feeling for me where I'm yeah. like, oh, I aw. Yeah, I loved you. Because this was the, and I should have known he was going to die. I really should have known because this was the season where we were learning all about him. Yeah. <laughs> right? I should have like seen it, it coming. It, and I thought he was going to die, but I, I did think that uh, payback. Um, <laughs> yeah. That bastard. What are you talking about? Soldier Boy? Soldier Boy, Jesus. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's been a week. I did think that Soldier Boy was going to be the one to kill him. I yeah. thought he was going to be like, I got everybody else. Right. Like whole, so now I get, I I get you too. Payback two. squad. Yeah. Like, you're the last one and you were the best. Of, like, giving some right. speech. He's like, but I don't give a fuck about that. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to kill I you. I got to kill you. Like, yeah. That's and and again, it makes happen. sense that everybody on that team had to die, right? So everybody, yeah. so everybody's accounted for, right? Yeah, yeah. And so, and I get it, but the other, because the other thing I didn't like was that Soldier Boy was just put back in the tube, and so I was like, yeah, like they just like brought him, him back on ice. Yeah, they brought him back, and then they put him away again. And I was hoping he was sort of going to be around. Oh, I think I liked will. his character. You think he's going to come back? Yeah. I, think, I hope I so. Think down Jensen the Eccles just did such a phenomenal job. Right, it was so. It was such uh, a but good again, job. I feel like the writers and Amazon aren't going to be like, well, the fans want it, so we'll just do it. If it I doesn't hope not. work, right? Yeah. If, if Soldier if Boy doesn't, doesn't fit. fit into the story, they're not going to bring him back. And maybe that's why they put they're him not away. Do fan service just because a fan asks for something, they're not going to yeah. give it to him. Jumping ahead here. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> Whoa. Sorry. So, um, I so what did you think of again? Super spoiler. What did you think of Soldier Boy being um, being Homelander's dad? I didn't like it. No, you don't like really. that idea. Obviously, I, I not a I father. I didn't have like... the reveal. Okay. And then for the finale, when they assume this big battle position, yeah, and he's like, "This is your grandson." Yeah, and then he's like, "What's up, Grandpa?" And I'm like, "Dang, this is kind of working for like this. This is kind of working." You're for like, me. "All right, I get so it." Once they made it part of the show, it it felt more natural. But in the moment, I'm like, "How's that gonna work out?" Yeah, and I do think so. I didn't mind it right after it was like better explained. But it, like exactly in the moment, yeah. I was like, "Well, what?" Because it is weird, and then and I agree. Yeah. In the moment, it was sort of like, "Oh man, like like does he?" Like, do we have to have this Darth Vader moment here? Yeah, because I'm like, where like team he's the dad. Yeah, like, like, come on, that's my boy. Like, I didn't want, but that. then they didn't do that. Correct, so which I'm is like, great. Oh, fine, I don't care now. But also, we know Homelander has daddy issues. Yeah, so we knew something was going to come of it, and mm. then now he has the motivation to do what he's doing now, yeah. which is raise his son and do he's it already, and do it on a Homelander, <sighs> do it Homelander style. Yeah, which is terrifying. Which is 
these I am so excited for season four for that reason alone. And just to it, see how awful that is. And it got be. greenlit before this season even started. Good. I believe like a week before this the they season like, started. Yeah. They're like, we'll keep this going. How could it not? How could it not? Okay. But it's also, and I was thinking about this. I think like four seasons is like going to be this. Like, I don't think you're going to be able to go past four. You think they're going to end I it at four? I think four has because to too much of a good thing. I agree. I, I mean, think. it's getting, it's getting, and I'm getting worried. For and, sure. And I think season four will still be great. I do think it's going to be the worst of the Interesting. Four. All right. But I think... Making some major calls here early I, on. I think the three, like the last three episodes, you can start savagely murdering people. Because at least That's, to my understanding... I didn't read the comics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But to my understanding, what I'm seeing, the comic material storyline is done. I, I think so. It, yeah. Is what is my understanding? Because it wasn't... I don't think it was a big it. run. It wasn't a no, big thing. No, no, no. Yeah. So as, as far as I'm here, from what I'm hearing, the comic story is done. Or at least yeah. it's clo- it's like very close to the end. Okay. So I think the last three episodes, like, just kill everybody. I think I you have to. I do. think you should. I think you absolutely think, should kill everybody. I just, mean, with the spinoff coming, like, just you can just savagely murder all I of hope, them. I hope so. Huey, I, everybody. Does. Starlight goes. Kamiko. Ugh break my soul but like she gets her face pulled off like something's got Frenchie up. dies for sure Frenchie drug over mm I, 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 I hope he lives I, maybe because he he's a family man I really yeah. want him to be around for his daughter but again he could like leave halfway through season four mm-hmm. and be yeah like, and be like I'm, I'm done. done with this but you I'm done yeah yeah and, and he's, he's just gone, gone. Yeah. Butcher dies. <laughs> Butcher a hundred percent dies. He's gotta die. There is no version of this show where Butcher and Homelander don't die. There's no version of this show where anybody continues to live. I yeah, really. I, yeah, that's MM. true. Yeah, I know. <laughs> We're like, like, no, and then has yeah, to live. He's, got to. he's so nice. But like, I also want we Huey to... to live. But like, I also want to see how they die. Yeah, if they do decide, right? So if they say, "Hey guys, season four is it?" We're like, the comic series has run its course. Like, we don't have any more stuff. So we're not gonna force it. Yeah, so like we're so we're gonna end it. Yeah, so we're gonna start exploding people from the inside yeah. out. <laughs> like, <laughs> so I'm like I want to see how Huey. You know dies. what? You know what the show did that I was surprised because I really thought he was gonna die early on was this whole uh, storyline with A Train that they're doing. I'm oh, wondering yeah. why they're doing that. This like comeback story for A Train. We saw him run one time this season, which I hated. That, that he didn't run more? Uh, no, I want to see him run oh, more. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But that's the thing I was telling you after we watched Herogasm. Hmm. That I thought... See, the penis exploding was bad. Yeah, it was bad. But, like, him dragging that man... Yeah, I know. Because that was an extended... And then you see him... Because that was an extended... So the penis thing was... Like, right, Whoa. but this was, like, ongoing... He was, for, like, dragging this, so he grabs the sky, him. runs full speed, and he's pulling his skin off. Yeah, yeah. He's ripping him getting, down to his bone. Yeah. Yeah. But for a good three, four, five seconds. Oh, right. You right, see right. his flesh mm-hmm. flying yeah. off his body. Oh, yeah. And absolutely. It, it, in that moment, I was like, that might be the gross. And then he's, thing when I've he seen. stops and you see it. Mm-hmm. And they, yeah. And they I, show him. Yeah. They show mm-hmm. it. And you're yeah. like, oh. <laughs> to me, that was gross. I can't handle it. That was bad because it, it was so long. You're right. It was. It wasn't quick. It was but yeah, a, like this thing a, with A Train. Like I want to see him run. I do too. Which is you know, why I'm I glad they. Think I'm, he'll be a big part of. I'm glad he got the new heart. But it's yeah. you know irony at its best. But here. again, <laughs> I also see him getting his like his calves ripped out of his legs. Yeah, yeah. By like, Homelander. By Homelander. Like, guess what? You're never gonna go anywhere. Yeah, he again. loses his legs. And he like pulls. He has to. He yeah. has to lose his legs. And this. I show. love how we're just how as gruesome as this guy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> he loses his legs. Maybe his arms. Yeah. But he loses limbs. But I think everyone's got to die. I think that's just the the satisfying conclusion to this. Yeah. Um. And because I, everybody's playing with fire, right? Which is yeah. also. If they don't die, it will upset me because I don't believe for one second everybody just gets away with this no. without any problems, issues, death. Like, there's just absolutely yeah. no way. Everybody's living yeah. the life on the edge, burning the candle at both ends here. Mm-hmm. No, people have to die. Qu- in this Queen Maeve show. is still alive. 
I yep. never. Did you think she died? I didn't think for one second. She no, died. I didn't think she died at all. Like I was like, ah, oh, she lost her powers like instantly. Yeah, because that's what happened. But again, that was like a good way to say like, hey, she's alive, but she's done. Like she's done. Yeah, she's done. She's and not. You're not going to see her anymore. Back, and then they kill her or something like right. whatever. Yeah. Or she doesn't come back at all. Maybe not Again, at all. I don't. I didn't read the comics. I don't know where these guys end up. I don't either. I don't know if they all end up dead. Maybe they all end up alive. Maybe they all sort of end up like that though, and they all just leave like one by one, right? And they all just which would kind of also be fine. So like, if you go an episode without Huey, you go Mm -hmm. through an episode without Kamiko and friends. Like they start falling off. Yeah, like one by one. Yeah, and then the last episode is like Homelander and just Homelander and Butcher. Right. Don't have this. Like that would be satisfying yeah, for me I, too. I I think so too. Like I didn't think of that. Season four, every episode is someone. It's like one less person. one less person. Yeah, like I could see that. So the big thing for me is is I'm on Twitter now. Oh man! So I'm I'm reading a lot of stuff on Twitter. Just the threads is awful place. <laughs> it's, it's just the worst. <laughs> it's very hard for me to get into, and it's funny because they. You know, you talk about like everything going on in the world. It's like, oh, all yeah, this stuff yeah. happens on Twitter. Well, it happens in for the world that we live in too. Yeah, and everybody was talking so much shit about Starlight. Why? Like, just like she doesn't do anything. She's weak. She like didn't contribute in the final fight. Like, she hasn't done anything for three seasons. Dang. And like the anger that just that built up inside of you. Me. And I and I wish I could remember the the content creator's name. But she went off. Oh, really? She's like, she's just an awful character. Like, blah, blah, blah. She did this whole rant on Starlight. What? Like, all her powers are just like, oh, her eyes light up and, like, nobody's afraid of her. And, blah, like, all this stuff. So, I was like, I was so mad. And then I'm like, she flew. Yeah. Now she can fly. She got off the ground. She, she learned to okay. suck in the power. So. And fly. She can, so, nobody can, else can fly that I'm aware of. So Homelander can, of course. Yeah. No, you're right. Yeah. But Starlight is disco- has now discovered that she has are the you, power to fly. Are you thinking she's like the ace in the hole for them? Or I don't know. But I, I think, and, and again, it wasn't just this one creator. It was everybody's like, yeah, she's a bitch. Like, what? she's weak. Like, all this stuff. And I'm like, she's like held her own yeah. in minimal form against Homelander a couple times. Oh, yeah. Like, she's done. She, like, beat the shit out of... Uh, well, but she's... She's beating Homelander on the public circuit. Right? Yeah. She's like beating him. Like in, from the in inside. The, yeah. She's beating him at his own game. Yes. That's exactly. The, that's the point. Which, which the, is the thing that Homelander hate like. Right. Has the hardest time with. And the, But that's the point of yeah. Starlight. Mm-hmm. Is to, because Homelander plays this game and Starlight's not having any of yeah, it. And she's yeah. the only one that right. had the. Right. Whatever he was the courage. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He's the only one that had the that courage. courage to be like, yo, I don't care. Like, like I, don't I don't care. care. Yeah. Everybody, everyone else bitched the deep bitched out. Everyone else actually oh, yeah. bitched out because they're so afraid of him. And I'm like, she's the only one. And that's a great point. She's the only one on that front yeah. that stood up to him. I'm like, yo, she's stronger than all you mother freakers. Yeah, because she actually had the guts to do but it. But when she like lifted, I'm like, yo, she got You're f- like, flying dang. out. Yeah. And again, she probably doesn't know that yet. She does now. She's like She's like, "Oh, I didn't know I could oh, do that. Right. I didn't know if I drew in enough power that yeah. I could lift and off like, the ground." Yeah. And like now I can do it or now I can store it within me so I can fly. Exactly. And I'm like, "That's yeah. crazy." So I love it. Starlight fantastic. Haters I out there. Love her. Come on, Shut guys. your face. Shut your there's, face right now. There's nobody that's done any wrong. No, everyone's I mean, playing a part. Because the, the, the thing is, you could say anything. Oh man, I hope the deep. But again, his character's not doing anything wrong. I hope the deeps penis He's gets just sucked off by an octopus. Guys, a nut job. He's an absolute. And like crazy you know, person. his ex wife, his wife, isn't done yet either. No, no, she's, she's wrote she's like a memoir on the tour. Really yeah, yeah, she's, she's on the she's book doing tour. A book tour. Yeah. And you know, Butcher's got some health issues. Oh yeah. Going on. Like there's He's got just, cancer. There's, yeah, right. There's still so much. We have the new person running for VP. I always forget her name that blows up heads. Yeah, the head she's exploder. A psycho. Absolute psycho. But like there's still so much to That's to what I'm lay saying. Out. We had so but many. I'm like, loose you ends. can do this over one season. Yeah. And like put a nice bow on it. Send it off. And it would be so so good, I think. After so four sweet. Seasons. Yeah, yeah. So I, I'm, I'm kind of that's hoping where it comes to its conclusion. I do agree too that we're getting to a point where it's like, okay, like 
it's been perfect so far. Don't keep messing with it. Yeah. Like def just wrap it up, end mm -hmm. it, so that we can end on a high note. And, and that's then, I agree. And then you can say, if you do that, you can say this is one of the greatest shows. Right. Ever. Exactly. Ever. Exactly. Yeah. Four seasons ended on a high you note. You don't have to, to be go. like, well, it was great for three seasons and then it fell off. Because you hear that with every show. Man, it fell off after season four. Like whatever it is, it fell mm -hmm. off after season six. But season seven was good. Yeah, and then it got back and up. Then and it was, it was like, okay. I mean, you can and say that about funny. anything. Gotham, The Flash. Right. Arrow. Like any of those shows, you can be like, yo, they were oh, yeah. so the good. The first three seasons are and the best. And then they got, and like, then Don't they get ridiculous. That. Yeah, and then they get dumb. Yeah, right. And I was nervous when I saw the trailer. I'm like, butcher, butcher a soup now? Yeah, who's gonna, gonna be make dumb. Everybody a soup? Come on, like we can't be doing that. Yeah. But then they wrote it out. He's not a soup. He can take a drug that makes him a soup. I was like, yeah. oh, I'm okay. And he, with and that. he can't take it forever. Yeah, he can't. Right? It's a limited it's run. It's a death sentence. So. Exactly. So I'm like, that makes sense. I like that a lot. I think after season four. Yeah. Let's let's put it because I want it to be. You want it to end on I that want it note. to be talked about as one of the best shows ever yeah. of all time. Yeah, absolutely. And if you end it after season four, if you end it after another great season, there's no reason it's not in that conversation. And if you end it in four seasons, then it's super bingeable yeah. all the time. All the you time. You could easily block out a month of your life. Yeah, you knock could them all always. Mm -hmm. You could always watch this show all the time if you end it in a small number of seasons. So I yeah I'm excited. I, agree. I am so the boys, excited for season, season three. Four. We're, in a, we're out of phenomenal. this pandemic thing. Maybe maybe not. But I feel like for <laughs> films and stuff like we yeah. don't have the pandemic delays. Right. So we're not gonna wait two years. No, we're gonna get it in 2023. Four. We'll get it next year. Yeah, absolutely. All right, that was our review for the boys. I want to get into this next The area. big one. This one's Because exciting. this is the one that I think that you you have personally been stewing on. This one's kept me up at night. So we are going to talk about... This one has kept me up at night. And I don't mean that as a joke. Right. No, you, I, you I, I, I mean that. I mean this as yeah. a point where like I'm like in bed like... And then it, like, I cannot sleep because of because I'm like this your is brain buzzing is... in my head. So we're going to talk about Miss Marvel. But from what I understand... The things that are bugging you are beyond this the, show. The things that are bugging me have nothing to do with Miss Marvel. Okay. So, so I'll go first. Okay. <laughs> so, okay. so I want to go first. <laughs> All right. So we start losing subscribers. <laughs> <laughs> We're at 109, dude. Yeah, We're at yeah. 74. Hey, what did you do? Why did you tank this show? <laughs> <laughs> I loved this show. Yeah. The six episodes that I saw, I like. I thoroughly enjoyed and there was a recurring theme throughout all six episodes. And it's that Amon Vellani is fantastic. Yeah. She's so great. Except she's, for episode five. She's so cool. Yeah. When yeah she she's like not even, even yeah, yeah, she's, she's in it for five minutes. But again, I still liked that episode. Yeah. It's a, cause it tells like, you yeah, the story, it's, right? It's a good history. But Amon Vellani, I'm on board with her. Yeah. She's I awesome. I can't wait to see her in the Marvels. I can't wait to see her in a Netflix Whatever, movie. Whatever. Yeah. She does that. Uh, oh, she's going places. Whatever, whatever. Oh, she's she does. doing things. She's so, she, yeah. so she, she's, they're picking her up. For she's sure. already established in my eyes the actress that I'm gonna go see her movies just because she's in it. Yeah, yeah. So she's she's she's, fun. she's like a she's gonna do a comedy. In, in my sure, opinion, something. I go watch a movie just because Will Smith's in it. I go watch a movie just because Anna Kendrick's in it. Yeah, just because Matt Damon's in it. Right. I'm not saying yeah. she's at their level, but they're but a I'm draw. Like, Yo. That name's on the movie poster. I'm gonna I'm gonna go watch it. Yeah. So she's done that for me after six episodes. That's and, which is incredible. Yeah. Yeah. Which is, which is I don't know who this girl was. That's an achievement. Like in, I don't know who because I don't was think you're the only one. No. I think a lot of people really enjoyed seeing her on TV. Yeah, a hundred percent. They really had a good time so with her. So now, character. if you tell me, hey, she's doing a this movie. Yeah. I'm, I'm like, cool. I'll go watch it. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I know, but there's no – don't care. She's in it. So cool. Watch she's it, in it. I like Which her. is great. I like watching her. And, and that was the she biggest good thing energy. for uh, Miss Marvel. She was really the thing that I loved the most. Yeah. She had a good family dynamic. The powers and everything were interesting. Everything she was going through. That was all fine and good. Yeah. But I – woo, excuse me. Yeah. <laughs> but I, I think she shines so much brighter than all that stuff. So I, I got super tunnel vision on her. Okay. Okay. And the, the way the series ended, I'm like, cool. All right. Let's get let's get the Marvels going. Let's do it. I'm not watching it for Brie Larson. I'm not watching it for Captain Marvel. I'm not watching it for Ram. I'm not. 
Yeah. Again, because I didn't enjoy Captain Marvel's character. I just I just watched one of her clips. Yeah. From a movie, <laughs> and I'm and I'm like, oh, cool, like cool. I'm glad this is coming up. Let me rewatch it, see what I think. And at the end you of were it, like, yep. And yeah. at the end of it, I'm like, I still feel exactly You're the like. Same. I'm glad like, I she I, didn't give yeah. me that. I'm, yeah, I was like, I'm glad because now I know it wasn't like a. This fluke. is how I feel. This is this is just how I feel. Right. So the Marvels, whatever next year, I'm going because of Volani's in it. That that's it. Yeah. That's the bottom line. All right. But the issue that I'm having with this, so the big reveal, big at the, reveal at the end. At the end is. She has a mutation in her body. They were very choosy about that word. There was a mutation. Mutation. Mutant. And I was like, oh, that's very, that's interesting. Mutation. And the reason that it's so interesting is because, so I guess Miss Marvel is the highest rated Marvel show. Yeah, but it was like one of the least viewed, right? Correct. Yeah. Yeah, I saw that. So it was the highest rated, but for six episodes, for five, for six and a half, no, for five and a half episodes, hmm. this show was talk shit. Everyone was like, this show's boring. There's nothing interesting. Blah, blah, blah. Like, uh, I don't really like her. You know, whatever. She's just another kid with powers. This is really boring. I don't really like this. Whatever. Yeah, whatever. Loki was better. Falcon okay. Winter Soldier was better. Dude, I even like Hawkeye better. This one's like, this one's low. This one sucks. Like, it's fine, whatever. It's like mid. Everyone calls it mid. And I'm like, but, oh, man, like, all right. You know, that's interesting. But then you're saying then this one thing. And then 10 seconds of an episode happened. Okay. So. Now, all go, of a sudden. They go, oh, you have a mutation. And I'm like, whoa, dang, she didn't mean that. That's wild. Yeah. I mean, it's cool because now I know I'm going to see more of her. That's exactly what I want. Right. But all of a sudden, this is the greatest show you've ever seen in the history of life? Because of that Because of moment. one thing? So you were talking trash about this show, about how boring it was, and it wasn't exciting. Mm-hmm. And you were on Twitter saying all that you were saying about this show. And then all of a sudden, it's, the, it's top tier, the best show you've ever seen out of all six. It's better than Loki all of a sudden? It's better than WandaVision all of a sudden? <laughs> how, how did this happen? Yeah. What is happening here? I So can I can I interject? Oh, yeah, you can. Okay. But, but that, right. that's the that's thing what's I'm bugging struggling you. struggling with. That's what's bugging you. Is that moment made it that moment big for people? We, we can all establish changes the entire MCU. It, it changes everything. Okay, so that's what I want to talk it, about. It changes everything. Yeah. But that doesn't make the show... The best Disney Plus show. Yes, I. It just I, doesn't. Right, and I agree with that statement. And actually, it bothers me that they introduced the mutant concept in a Disney Plus show. Yes, and that's glad, what bothers me. And I'm glad you got to that because that was my next point. Oh, okay, yeah. So I, I was actually upset that this show introduced it. We've been waiting for this for and, so and, and long. This is no disrespect to Miss Marvel at all. No, it's not. That's not what I'm saying. That's not what I'm saying. But we've been waiting for this is all that we've been asking for. Yeah. For so long. And this, this is, is how, how you do it? it? Yeah. I don't understand that at all. It was a Imagine sentence. the theater reaction. Right. On opening night right. of Wakanda Forever. Yep. Or wh- whatever. Whatever, yeah. The Mar- what, whatever it is you decide. Probably Wakanda Forever, I would guess. Because right. that's sure. the next one coming up. Imagine the crew we go with. The, the packed house and you hear that same line in, in a movie theater with everybody. Yeah. You go, Imagine scr- the screams. You're like, Oh screams. my God. You're like excited and this and all that. Yeah. And again, it's no disrespect to Miss Marvel because no. again, I enjoyed the show, but that's the moment that you decide to reveal something that the fans and everybody have been wanting yes. and dying for right. for so long. Right. That was so the wrong time. I completely agree. Because, because I would have done anything to be next to my buddies and you in the theater. Be what? like, dude, like, we're no getting way. it. Finally. Oh, my God. And hot, like just cr- the crazy energy of the theater. It bummed me out. And it I'm really like, did. Wow. But I wanted like a Captain America picking up Thor's hammer moment. Yes. To introduce... Mm-hmm. x-men right mm-hmm. like i wanted a moment where we were like 
some like they're in trouble like someone's like oh man we're gonna die i'm not sure how to, we're gonna get out of this situation and then all of a sudden we just see like a laser like shing, yeah knock a bad guy down and you're like the, what and it turns yeah cyclops. cyclops yeah and you're just like no way how getting chills thinking wild about it. would that have been it would have been amazing that would have been a moment that would have rivaled cap catching me on yes absolutely then you would have had this new debate right which moment was bigger oh man which moment no, do you no, remember x-man man no, when dude, they introduced no the x got it that was way oh, cooler bro geez. you would have had this oh, new yeah. wave of yes, excitement absolutely absolutely and that was that was such a bummer for me but it was such a bummer that everybody's like this is the greatest show of all time. this is great oh my god it's the greatest show of all time yeah and, and i'm it, like no it's not well and i understand when you're like i was already on board with this show yeah you weren't now you're mm -hmm piggybacking off of it yeah right exactly so now you're like oh all of a sudden a fan when no you weren't i was a fan the whole time yeah now you're trying to say and again and, and i don't need to be why about my level of fanness because i was a fan for miss marvel that's the that was that my was the, favorite right. part about this yeah. show yeah yeah and um them saying oh well there's a mutation that didn't make me any more of a fan to me that locked in like oh i'm gonna see her again she's coming yes. back yes sweet that's what it locked in for Should me. Be, yeah, she's, gonna... she's she's coming back. Yeah, but for everybody, be like, oh my god, this is top tier Disney Plus. Oh, like, who are you? Yeah. To me, you're just the fakest person. Yes. Because I wanted to do the thing where you like you you know you take a tweet from like months ago and oh, the show's yeah. boring and and then put it next just to like their Spider Man Homecoming and this put it isn't next really to their... that and I'm like. Like, yeah. What do you, you said it was the most boring show. And all of, all of a the sudden. Shows, and now you're saying it's top, it's better than Wanda, it's better than, Lo like, it's, yeah. what? This show was, I think, better than some of those. I think it but was. Like for these, for all, all of a sudden to be like, this is, this is so great. This is so great. Well, so. Which drives me crazy. It just drives me crazy. I do, I, so I, I do want to review the yeah. show as like a, as the show itself. But I yeah, can we'll understand do that. when that's just my overall yeah, yeah. <laughs> frustration that I had to get out. But I do understand your frustration when you see because it's this is not the only show it happens to. This is not the only Marvel property it happens mm -hmm. to. People can hate a movie the whole time and then an end credit scene makes it the best movie but, of all but time. It, and it, it's and it bothers me about Marvel because like did they do that on purpose? Yeah. Did, yeah. did, I uh, mean, hundred percent. And again, the, maybe this show was done filming. Maybe it wasn't. Maybe this wasn't the plan. Maybe they're like, oh my God, nobody's watching this show. Yeah. How do we get people to watch do? this show? We need the, the viewers are low. What do we do? What do we do about, what do we I, do to get people to go back and watch? I and, can't. And that, maybe that's not what it is. I'm super big into conspiracy theories, but I'm like, yeah, now people are going to go back and watch. Now your viewers are like all this stuff's because people are going to want like whatever. But I can't imagine being an executive in a room and being like, how are we going to introduce the X-Men? And be like, I got it. I got the perfect idea. You're going you're gonna to love this. You're going to yeah. love it. The very end of Miss Marvel. And they're like, Miss who? We'll, we'll have her buddy tell. Miss what? We'll have her friend that we've known for five minutes make the reveal to who? Oh, is he, uh, is he a genetic? Uh, is he a PhD in genetics? Uh, no, no he's an eighteen-year-old kid in high school. He's just a guy. Uh, but he's like a really smart eighteen-year-old mm -hmm. in high school. So he studies genes. Oh, okay. And again, great guy. I love the guy. He's funny. Yeah. It it did. We'll we'll get we'll go back to the episode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When uh, when he walked in on Kamala, when she was about to have her the kiss. Oh, with Kamran. Yeah. Yeah. And he walked in. He's like, <sighs> Yeah. We we gotta go. <laughs> yeah. And I'm like, listen, guy, I've been there before, yeah. buddy. Listen, I've had a couple oh. turn around the corner at the wrong time moments, too. No. And that shit hurts. We, I felt that with we've him. We've all been a Bruno. I felt that sure. with him. I'm like, am I good for you for, like, keep, like you kept going. And, and, and. You, like, kept going. I, so I have a lot of problems with the show. A lot of problems. Mm. I actually don't like it that much if i'm being perfectly mm -hmm. honest i'm not a big fan yeah, but i agree fine. with you i don't remember her name what's her name aman valani aman valani is i think by far the best part of this whole yeah. show 
by far. I think she's and she, she is the show. And she, she when is she's the show. in a room with the other characters, there's only a few other actors in this show mm-hmm. that I think are actually as good as her. Mm-hmm. But when she's in a room with her friends, there's like no competition yeah. between them. She's like just it's all blowing much better. them she's out of so the water. So much better, yeah. And it's actually distracting for me. Where yeah. I'm like, wow, you're a lot better than mm-hmm. this guy. Yeah. And I think it was a bad casting in that sense. But I don't like that she falls for Kamran at all. I don't like it at all. Because yeah. it was established immediately that she falls for him because he's hot. That is it. It's hot guy. And hot guy. I don't like that at and, and, all. And, and then he got so... the same powers. And I was like, that's bullshit. Yeah. He should not get those powers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I, it, I was so it's, bugged. It's so tough for me because I don't know this. Like I don't know if she's yeah, supposed to be with this who guy. Who cares? Like I'm like it doesn't I don't know play on screen. It's, yeah, though. That's it doesn't true. matter. I don't care what the comics say. Is he? I don't he, care. Is he an evil guy? Is he a good guy? Is he? So a, in the that, show, that's what I don't in the understand. Show, so I'm like I don't know if I'm for him or against him. He was raised to be a bad guy. Yeah, and he becomes good in the end. Right. Okay. That's his whole deal. Okay. And Kamala changes him to be a good guy. Yeah. Right, because he ends up with the red daggers at the mm. red daggers. I think. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, he yeah. He does. He goes back end. to. So he ends up a good guy. He starts off as a bad guy. We don't know he's a bad guy until it's explained yeah, what his yeah. mom is doing, which I also didn't like. And again, Yo, she I was... could go on and on and on about Bro, who was the villain in this. Oh my gosh, I was so bugged when his mom died. Who was the villain? Because I was like, hey, wasn't that your bad guy? No, it was the. The crew, the cleanup crew. Yeah, the damage control. Yeah, it was the damage control. Which is stupid. And I'm like, So stupid. And again, it was very cool when Kamala got her powers when she like does the... Yeah, and she's... But I'm like, again, nothing else around that was going on mattered to me. No, it didn't. It was cool when I saw her get her... That's all I cared about. I didn't yeah. care about the the kids back at the school. No. You know, I was like, oh, cool. Her parents are there. Like, I enjoy her parents. But, like, that, again, that still doesn't really matter. I'm like, yeah. I just see this one thing that is so good. And you never believe for one second that anybody's going to get hurt. No, of course There's not. There's zero stakes. I really, what was the, the main zero damage stakes. control lady? What was her name? Yeah. Do you oh, remember? I, I was idea. hoping she was going to get her face pulled off by Homelander. Yeah. <laughs> like... <laughs> <laughs> I was super. She was just super annoying. Yeah, yeah. So annoying. And you and and again, you can correct me if I'm wrong, but I never really get the sense of why they're after them. I don't know, like what the I, I, what the was problem it is because they had the power. Was it there was like a power but, thing? Yeah. But, well, they were like, we don't know what their thing is, so we need to capture them so that we can act, yeah, we can I question think, them to figure out what. Is yeah, what they I think are. it was because she was running around and everybody saw this nightlight. Right. Like. They're like, what is that? We gotta get a. So, but that was the whole reason they mm-hmm. were capturing her, right? Like, I believe like so. it was not. There was nothing established in the show that gave them any other reason as to why they were after them, other than no. We need to capture them to bring them in for questioning. Yes, I believe so. Okay, so it, stupid. It, and, and that all started with so the, dumb. The gas station or the convenience store getting blown up. With oh, uh, under I, you're on the in episode five, you five, mean yeah, with the very at the end? end when yeah. it blew up? I think that's what drew them back and like, all right, now we got to deal with this because yeah, but they end so, up doing a, stores are they end up doing up. a switch, right? Because Kamran's mom, which I forget her name, my apologies, dies because mm-hmm. she sacrifices herself to save the world so yeah. that her son is alive. Her mm-hmm. spirit goes into her son. I don't, I don't remember. Gives him I, power. I don't remember, he doesn't need a bangle. That's yeah. sweet. Like, I would like his powers. He uses, like, both of his hands without anything. Yeah. It's just in him. And I'm like, yeah. Like, yeah. that's... I, I have a lot of problems with this show. I actually yeah. did not enjoy it that much. Yeah, and that's fine. To be fine. perfectly honest. And, and that's that's the great thing about all of this. Yeah. Some people loved it. Some people hate it. Like, it, it's, it's fine for whatever it is. But I want to know why people love it. And but I want for, to talk to those people. But for it to be all of a sudden the greatest thing you've ever seen because they revealed that the X-Men are coming. Yeah. And then the whole thing with the theme song was like a whole other thing. And I'm like, ugh. <laughs> like it, it was just a lot. Like it, it was a lot to be on Twitter. And then it, it brought up this whole other conversation of the MCU. Gotcha. And I loved some of the points people were making. Interesting. So I have we're gonna get her on TikTok too. 
Yeah. So I was yeah. going through some of the TikToks, and people were making great points. About why this show about, is good? No, about why the MCU is like... Oh, the MCU in general. Yeah. And I'm like, cool. Like There's a lot real. of people on board with this idea that this content and the way we're going, it's just not good. Yeah, I agree. I, I, and, I agree. And, and the biggest thing that just made my heart light up is people are like, you guys are shoving this shit down our throats. Yeah. And it's not fun anymore. It's not special anymore. Yeah. Well, and I, everybody acting like they're a big superhero fan is not fun anymore. It's not yeah, special. When you and make I'm it for like, the masses. Cool. Yeah. And I get it that Disney is a company and they're going to make a bajillion, hillion, trillion dollars. Mm-hmm. And that's fine. That's what you're there for. If I was out there running the show, I'd probably be doing the same thing. I don't, yeah, but, but I don't but understand. It's, it's, it's the people, like the ground level people. Mm-hmm. That are like, this is not good anymore. Yeah. I'm tired of watching these shows. I'm bored with watching these shows. Yeah. And all the videos, and I'll send them to you, I didn't. And they all end the same way. And they're like, guess what? We're going to do it anyways. Yeah. If they keep making shows, they got us. They got me. They got you. They got all of us. Yeah, we're all going to keep watching. And that's watching. how everybody's TikToks ended. They're like, but, but we're, we're gonna watch it. Next week. I think hey, we're always g- hopeful that the next one's gonna be good. Mm-hmm. I really am, and and it's not even just Marvel. It's all. I think Disney Plus was the worst thing to happen that to that company, not because of how much we're getting, but because quality has taken a big yeah. hit. Mm-hmm. And and I think I'm always always hopeful because they had me on the hook for so many years. For 15 years, I've been mm-hmm. on the hook. Yeah, because I got really good quality content yeah. from this company. Mm-hmm. And so to believe that they're blowing it all in two years, I like, I can't yeah. imagine that happening. And I keep thinking the next one is going to be good. Yeah. This one wasn't that Dang, good, I gotta send you those. but the next one's going to be I, good. I got to send you those videos because, again, they all follow the same theme. Yeah. I mean, I, the, I would imagine they're so. They're like, you know, it was this and we were all – but we're all so invested – that they and, and I said it in a in a previous episode, they could do whatever they want, and we're just we have to be okay with it. Yeah, they're like so in in eleven years or whatever mm-hmm. it was, they released twenty four movies mm-hmm. in eleven years, and they've like they've released thirteen in the past eleven months. Yeah, and it's too much. And it and it's too much because it's not good. It wouldn't but, matter if it was good. Correct. Yeah. So so it is funny that they're again. I don't know what the percentage is. There's so many of us fans. That, mm-hmm. You know, we classify as fans, but it's funny that people now are like, this is guys, I'm tired. Well, but it was, but it was all Disney plus. Yeah. Doing. Like and, it and was all Disney, because of Disney. But they're plus. like, well, now you got to watch WandaVision if you want to go to Multiverse of Madness. And now you're going to have to, and I'm like, dude, you're, but you're right. Yeah. And people are like, yo, if I could just watch Disney plus and it didn't have anything to do with Wakanda forever, then, then it, it wouldn't then matter. Be fine. Yeah. But dude, now I got to watch like 13 Disney plus shows before you're going to let me go watch Wakanda forever. And I'm yeah. like, dude, I'm tired. And people are like, yo, I just want to like, I want to turn on like, uh, whatever reruns because I like, I can't handle this anymore. Yeah. And I'm like, I am glad I'm not the only one that feels that way. But everybody's right. TikTok and YouTube video and whatever ended the same way. And they're like, We're guess gonna what? Watch. I'm gonna watch She Hulk when it comes out. Yeah, I'm gonna watch She Hulk. I'm gonna watch She Hulk again, and yeah. I can be as frustrated and I can talk all the shit I want. And I only found. Like relief and knowing, cool. I'm not the only one that sees this shit anymore. It's it is strange. I'm like, not again, the, the only one that sees this. Only th- but yeah, you're right. I'm gonna watch the, your fucking show. The only thing that I can relate it to is being in a dysfunctional relationship that we can't get out yeah. of because we had so much trust in them, and even though they betrayed us so many times, for some reason we still feel like yeah. we can trust them. I don't and know it's why. Great. And then it just, and I could go on forever just because yeah. I've read so much the past three days. So I could go on forever. Yeah. But I just, I just watched, it was Infinity War. Yeah. No, no, no. It was Endgame. And it was Endgame. Mm-hmm. And I was like, this is so good. Man. So good. This is fantastic, man. So we got. This is top tier. So Kat and I got a new TV. And in order to break it in, we watched. Yeah. We watched we, some great clips. Right. Well, no, we watched Infinity War and Endgame. Oh, you all oh, the you way re- through. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. We gotcha. rewatched Infinity cool, cool, cool. War and Endgame. Yeah. So good. And it's, it's so phenomenal. Good. And it's phenomenal. But like because, but the quality of these mm-hmm. movies 
it's is the, at the highest level that it could possibly ever there's be. There's nothing it, above and, it. And, and I was watching, the, and, the, and the boys were asking me questions. They're like, how did that happen? How did this happen? I'm like, dude, you don't even know how it <laughs> happened, bro. But like, and I built it because it was like special. Right. And they're like, well, we're going to do Secret Invasion. I'm like, it doesn't matter. No. Yeah. It's, I'm not going to be sitting in the theater watching Secret Invasion and have that same feeling. Yeah, I agree. I'm not. There's no shot. There's nothing you can do. There's no Ryan Reynolds. There's no Hugh Jackman that's going to give me that feeling when Cap caught Mjolnir. Right. When Parker got snapped away. Yeah. When Tony died. Oh, Those I know. moments are forever on the Mount Rushmore of moments. Yeah. And I and I'll say and I'll say I'll put it on video, <laughs> put it on the internet. It's out there for everybody. That there's not a moment that they're gonna do that's ever gonna come close to those moments. No, no, I. But, there's just there's just not. But they secret could. Inva- is it secret invasion, secret wars? I don't know what it's called. No, it's secret invasion. Secret yeah. invasion. Well, that's what it's based on. Yeah. So if you do that movie tomorrow, mm-hmm. it's not gonna touch no, what no, Endgame. No. It's just not gonna touch it. But but the frustrating part is that it could if they just. Were, mm-hmm. If they were exactly. patient again, yep. mm-hmm. and they decided to build it up again, we could get to that point Correct. again. Correct. But they're like, no, everything all at once. Yes. Here's everything. So now we have mm-hmm. no build up to those hundred and ten percent. And I, I loved Shang Chi. Yeah, I I did. It's such I, a I, good ca- movie. I care about that guy. Yeah, such a good movie. But if he were to die tomorrow, I wouldn't. I'd be like, oh man, like that was a bummer. Man, that's, is that Dang. Like to see him anymore? Simu right, Leo, so, so what are we gone. Gonna, you guys were getting pizza or what? Like, that's the kind of moment it yeah. would be. Yeah. Dude, Spidey, Spidey got snapped away. Dude, we were, like, done for, like, three days. <laughs> <laughs> like, you, like, your buddy's like, hey, man, you doing all right? Yeah, man, you know, I'm getting better every day. Like, Dude, you seriously, those man. Moments. But we, I was still like that this past week. Exactly. Where we, saw it. I, we finished Infinity War one night, and I was like, like, Am whoa, I gonna I be able to, to sleep without watching Endgame? Just knowing that he comes back, yeah. like I need to, I need to see him come back, so or else you, I'm not gonna feel good. So any of these new people that you've brought in, no man, you're not, not gonna, gonna have that. No, either. no, we're, we're not. not. Cap, cat, like any, any of those big moments. Yeah, we're not getting that anymore. And they're gonna do them, but am I gonna care? You're not gonna care because they're not being patient anymore. And that, they're, and, and they're that, trying to give it to us. Bummer of it. Too quickly. And it's you know, I, I don't know that there's a character out there right now that I'm like, dude, if I lost them, like, it would be tough. No. Not like, a, it would be tough. Not a single one. You know, we lost the big ones. We lost Cap. We lost the ones we, we cared about Iron already. Man. Again, Thor's still kicking. Like, there's characters that are there. Maybe yeah. Thor would be the one. I mean, yeah, that's. Yeah, that's, he's one of the OGs that I think. Yeah, that like, we that's would care tough. About. But again, oh, yeah. even, like. And again, I'm excited for these. I'm Kate Bishop would be super cool to see in like on a big screen, mm-hmm. like with some budget. Kamala is going to be super cool on a big screen with some budget. Right. Um, Shang Chi was cool on a big screen with some budget. Like that's all fine and good. Yeah. I'm excited. I'm excited for that. Yeah. But is it going to have the impact that like, dude, we still talk about to this day with our friends? I think. I, yeah, I I do think that one of the problems that we're facing is that we don't actually know what the team is anymore. I have right. no idea. We like is. we don't know who the Avengers are, mm-hmm. which the Avengers kind of again just kind of grounded us. Okay, we knew these are the Avengers. Yeah, and then you do and everything then, else. Yeah, and then we we could wrap our heads mm-hmm. around that, right? And we cared about these people, but yeah. right now we're still so scattered. Yeah, we don't. I don't know where to who I'm supposed to care about. What mm-hmm. story? It's like it's all over the place right now. Yeah, we have Doctor Strange out there. We have Thor out there. And, I'm, and we have uh, Captain Marvel out there. And yeah. I'm like, I don't – am I supposed to care about these people? Are they the Avengers? I don't think so. Like, I, what is happening right now? And, and, the, and the reason the Twitter stuff is so scary because people shred you to pieces if you're, like, saying anything. Oh, if you, God. like, say one thing, you're like, well, let me tell you why you're wrong. And this is what it's leading up. Dude, I don't give a shit. Right. I don't care. No clue. And you know I what? don't care. You don't know what it's leading up to. Yeah, you have no idea you either. Don't zero sit clue. there and tell me. Because no. guess what? This is what I think. I don't even think Kevin Feige knows what it's leading up to. Not yes. anymore. Yo, I'm, I'm making statements out here. Yeah, not I'm anymore. St- and, uh, dude, come at me, whatever you want to do. Yeah. I think he's kind of like, well, we could do that. Like, well, because I think dude, they ca- there's, like you said, there's no way that they were sitting in there and like, we're going to introduce the X-Men to Miss Marvel. No, that, that's I, our, don't that's our plan. I don't believe that's that at all. I don't believe that at all. But I also don't believe 
for one second that Kevin Feige had any of these people on his map. Mm. I think that Disney came to him and said, we're going to open up a streaming service. We we need you to make these shows. Yeah. So make them fit. But you can't say that, Sam, because you're being a uh, bad fan. But that's what like the that's fandom has what's become. What's probably happening? We experienced though. toxic fandom with Obi Wan. We all know yeah. that situation, and it was bad. Yeah. And and Marvel it's fans tough. are doing it the same way. Like, well, you can't say anything bad about us. You can't talk about us because we're the greatest thing ever. And I'm like, dude, you are a toxic fan. You yeah. just are. And it, it is hard. You just again, are. I again I, I I go back to it being dysfunctional because I'm like, you're talking about a company that gave us the best of the best that there is ever. And, and then I, yeah. they're giving us some of the worst. And people are like, I like they can't wrap their heads around that. And, right? and, and for those people understand the frustration. Right. They're like, right. dude, we got so we got great things for so long. Yeah. But the people that are like saying, Well, it's still it's still great. It's dude, yeah. it's no not. it is not. It's not no, if it you're is saying not. this is still great, you weren't you're here. You're delusional. In, you were not here in two thousand seven right. when this shit when this ship got going. Right. You weren't here. Yeah. You're I new agree. you're new to the game. Yeah. You got in halfway through. Yeah. Because anybody that experienced that eleven years, the anybody whole that was thing. in that theater. Yeah. When Endgame happened, when we were all there together, yeah. too, with our black butt, and we like, knew what it on, meant, yeah, and we knew what it meant to lose everything and yeah. to have like everybody snapped away, and dude, we didn't know what was gonna happen, and then to go into that theater a year later and to a see year everybody later, come a back, a year later, to see Thanos sitting there, snapped into like yeah. you weren't there for that moment. If yeah. you're saying that what we're getting now and what they're giving us, it's is it's top good, tier. yeah, because yeah. it's not. Yeah, you're, you're new to the game, and that's fine. I welcome new fans. That's great. Yeah, that's yeah. super fine and good. good. But to say that the way we're being, and maybe we're entitled, maybe we're entitled fans. Like you need to give everything needs to be perfect. I. That's not what I'm saying. No, either. I'm not saying that either. And, and I'm just saying that they have money, mm -hmm. they have resources, they have everything that they can do to make every show. That was a good show. I really enjoyed that show. It wasn't the greatest show I've ever seen, but I I enjoyed it. Yeah, you but could do every show. As a good show, even even that, I just think the strategy is wrong right now. I, I it's, what, it's, it's it's just it's not even of, this show, this yeah. show. Dude, like, and like, yo, Joe, dude, let me watch something out. Like, God bless. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna go watch. I'm gonna go watch Doctor Shit. Well, I'm gonna go watch Multiverse. No, I'm gonna watch Wandavision first. And you're like, oh, oh my shoot, god! Man, I didn't. I didn't watch. I don't. I don't subscribe to Disney Plus. And then you're not gonna know what's going on. Sorry. And yeah. I'm like, bro. But there's no let way me I breathe. I don't believe for one second that that was the plan all along. At least from Kevin Feige's perspective. And I just don't think the guy's that a these... the guy's yeah. a genius, man. And so I'm not like, talking again, bad about I, him. He's I know, a genius. I know what I know what Disney Plus is saying, right? They they as a business and from a business angle, you have to get people to get onto your service. Mm -hmm. And for anybody to to tell me different, they're delusional. Yeah. You are delusional if you believe for one second that this wasn't a play to get subscribers. And it worked. And it's but well, it's working. What? They're not having high viewerships. Nobody no. watched Miss Marvel. I know. It didn't crack the top five. And that's and again, that didn't. People are not. It's not getting the same hours. And I do think that they are going to have a shift because I do think they're going to. They have to switch to quality. I don't. I. I don't even know what shows are coming out in 2023. But I would imagine that if I was an executive yeah. at Disney Plus and we released all these shows and we saw this from one division, we saw this downward trend of viewership. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. and, oh, okay. Maybe people don't care about these as much as we yeah. thought they did, and maybe making. Forcing them to come over into our service to watch them is not a good idea. Yeah. But hey, we got the subscribers. Cool. Let's go ahead and give them, deliver them some quality content. Great. And then maybe that'll get us back into the, yeah. the top five of viewership, mm -hmm. right? That is the plan moving forward. If I'm an executive in that room, I'm like, look, mm -hmm. I get it. We have the subscribers on Disney Plus, yeah. but we're losing. We're losing the people. And, and, and I think you will. And a lot of like what I do at my job is like we talk about market share all the time. Like, that's yeah. the most market share. Marvel's got, they're, they're winning. Oh, yeah. It's crazy. Because if, if you want to watch a superhero show, where are you going to go? Yeah, Disney Plus. You go to Disney. That's it. Yeah. You go to Amazon for one show. Yeah. 
but you don't. Netflix doesn't have any. You go to Amazon because you already have a Prime account. Yeah, exactly. But yeah. you're not going to Netflix to watch any superhero content. No, nope, zero. You can go to HBO Max to watch some of the old DC stuff. Right. Yeah. Especially and animated. It, yeah, all the animated stuff is all there. I love all that stuff. Yeah. And it's going to be crazy because I've, I've been talking about DC forever. And people are like, dude, you're so lame. DC sucks. <laughs> and they'll, they'll have a come up. I promise you. Oh, yeah. And they, then everybody they, will they, be on board. They, they got a new boss. Dude, I'm, I'm telling you, they're having meetings every day with their new boss. Yeah. And yeah, they're yeah. planning out years. The next 10 years. Then yeah. they're blocking it out. And I trust this guy. Yeah. I really trust this guy. I think he's going to do a good thing. But I don't believe just from... What I'm hearing, just reading an article off the internet, that he's not, dude, we got to do it right. We got to do it right now. He's like, no, no, no. Whoa, hold up. Yeah, let's let Listen, this. Listen, we're canceling that. We're not, that's not going to work. That, no, let's can, that's not going to work either. So he's he's got a playbook. Right. Well, and if I'm him. He's got a playbook. Yeah. Zaslav is like, yeah, well, I don't know. <laughs> he's not my buddy. I'm not I'm yeah, poker but again, with him. But if I'm him, I'm looking over at Disney Plus being like, hey, it's not going well. Yeah. Not going well as mm-hmm. far as quality goes, as far as reviews and ratings and viewership go, mm-hmm. it's not going well. Yeah. Okay. Here's our chance mm-hmm. to come in here, but we need to we we get a, we get one chance to come in you, here and DC deliver. Only, yeah. They and we need to chance. deliver mm-hmm. the best that we've ever delivered. Yeah. And what is that going to be? We need to figure that out. Mm-hmm. And that's so what I'm telling you. They're over there. They're cooking over up there at something. Warner Discovery. They're having meetings every day. Oh yeah. Oh, but yeah. I don't for one second believe he's like, we got to get it up right now. We got Because he's canceled a bunch of projects <laughs> that they yeah. had going. And he's like, we're not doing that. Because they had the Disney Plus model for a mm-hmm. minute, right? Yeah. Oh, they're releasing 15 shows. We got to release 15 Correct. shows. And he's like, and they And they no. did the, they no, did no, the no, switch. No, 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 no. New people came in. People left. Yep. And you, you get this, the, the big boss. Yeah. Whatever you want to call him. Yeah. And, he, and I believe he's saying that's cool. But like, let's look at the long game here. Yeah, let's and, not and, do that. And I believe it's it's gonna be great. Yeah. Again, I'm very biased. I'm way more of a DC fan. Sure, sure, and that's sure. totally fine. But if they if that model works, yeah, you know, and then they get let's as, a, as an extreme example, they get Cavill back. He comes back in. He does a couple things. Mm. You know, they get Momoa back to doing his thing. They get some new people in. They get yeah. Blue Beetle coming up. They do a Nightwing. They get yeah. the Green Lantern HBO finally kicked off. Yeah. Pattinson continues what he's doing, which right. is a huge success this year. Yeah. Don't you come up to me and be oh bro, DC rocks. Get <laughs> out. Go back and watch your favorite. At that point get though. Out at of that here, point bro. you get that tweet, right? DC sucks. I love DC. Yeah, I get and you're dope. like, oh my gosh. And I posted something on our Instagram about it. Yeah. Of yeah, the yeah. other day. Yeah. And people are like, what, you like a DC fan? Like that's like right now in this time? And I'm like, Yep. Yeah. Absolutely. With, with everything going 100%. on. Hundred percent. Guess what? I'm still watching all those I'm DC saying. movies. I wish that I would I wish I could talk to somebody. I'm still wa- I'm so of course I'm still watching that stuff. Yeah. Bro, you know it sucks, right? Cool. I still enjoy the hell out of it. When I'm at home, I got my TV, my soundbar blasting. You're like, yeah, Dude, sucks, Man huh? Man of Steel, all back to whatever, the Dark Knight, Nolan's, any of that stuff. Yeah, any of it. Dude, I love it. And what they have coming down the pipeline, things we don't even know about. Yeah. Blue Beetle next year coming up. I know. Pattinson's going to continue to do Go what do he's another doing. another Batman. He, that's all fine and good. Dude, yeah. I'm telling you, there's things that are on paper. They're like, hey, get this. You start writing this. You start doing this. We'll say 2026. Have it done by then. Yeah. <laughs> 2027. Have it done by then. We'll get you on HBO Max. We'll get this. Get him come in. Let's get his you know test screening done. Let's do all that. And we don't know anything about what's no, happening right now. No, of course not. But it is happening. Yeah. And again, if I'm that them, I know, I would strike right now. <laughs> yeah. All right, man. We did it. That was on- kind of a Miss Marvel. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I thought it was cool when she got her powers. I'm yeah. excited for what's next. Um, we'll talk about a cutscene real quick. Oh, big uh, debate on that. Did she switch? Did she turn into? Um, did Captain she have Marvel? the bangle on her arm when she? So the I didn't pay attention. The showrunner said that they switched places. That's what it looked she, like. She came out. It looked like that. it switched. So now I didn't like the whole huh, and then switch. Yeah. <laughs> You're like what? Yeah. So apparently they switched places. That's so what it seemed Kamala like. Kamala is floating off in the middle of space somewhere, which I don't understand because I don't think she can breathe in space. So we'll see what so happens. So I don't know where she went. But again, my excitement level for the Marvels is up because of 
Amon oh, Vellani, not yeah, because yeah, yeah. of Brie Larson. Not that I don't like Brie Larson, yeah. but that's that's yeah. what she's what's gonna get me there on yeah on Thursday night. Like I agree, I agree. But the show for me, eh, maybe a six. Not six? that great. Not that great for me as a show. I mean, the, I got to figure out a new rating system. But the biggest rating system for me on anything is: Am, am I going to go back? Oh. Am I going to watch it again? No, I'm, I'm probably not going to. Never going to watch the show again. Never, never. But it, but it again, and and I said it said in a couple episodes. If somebody's like, hey, we, like let, let's watch this. I'm like, have you seen Miss Marvel? I was like, yeah, I've seen it before. Oh, cool, let's watch it. I'd be like, all right. That'll never happen. That's fine. If, if, <laughs> again, if, if it were to happen, I'd be like, okay, cool. Yeah, like, you I, would I can, watch I can it. sit yeah. through it. Right. I wouldn't be like, no, I'm not watching that. Yeah. Like, I can sit through it again if right. I have to, but I'm not going to go back and pick it up and watch it again. Yeah, I agree. I agree. I just but wasn't a, just just wasn't a big fan. wasn't a fan. And that's fine. All we right. We got a lot of stuff coming up, so we got uh, – Stuff coming up. I mean, nope. nope. That's going to be I know. I can't time. wait. We got Bullet Train. That's going to be big If time. I can get to Super Pets, I would like to watch I'll, Super I'll, Pets. I'll probably too. do it. We'll I'll, check out Super Pets. I'll probably get to it. I watched uh, Spiderhead. Oh, yeah. With uh, Chris Hemsworth. Chris Hemsworth. And uh, Top Gun guy. Yes. Miles Teller. Miles Teller and the director of Top Gun. Oh, is it? Also directed it. Oh, okay. And super interesting premise. Interesting. I was like, wow, this is really, really cool. And the movie just never did anything. Oh, that's a bummer. So I was kind of, I was like, oh, this is where it's going to be big. Oh, shit. This is, oh, okay. And well, then nothing next happened. Scene, next yeah. scene. Oh, then. shit. This is it. This, it's coming. Wrong. No. Oh, all right. It'll be the next scene that something's going to happen. And then just and nothing happens. And the credits happens. rolled. Okay. Like, Not a good. Okay. Nothing. Right. But right. man, what a bummer when you have a big movie. Like yeah, that. I like know. Movie stars. You have a good opportunity here. And the Gray Man. Gray. I'm gonna go see that. Oh yes, that's actually. It's coming out on Netflix. List. A in, week, a week after release, it's gonna come out on weeks, Netflix. One week. Uh, so two in it's, uh, it's out in theaters now. So it released on Friday in theaters, and mm -hmm. then it, the release for Netflix is next Friday. Okay, so it's a week. Yeah, it's yeah. one week. And but again, star-studded cast. I uh, know. Couple great directors on this. Oh, that'll one. for sure be on our next. Like we're doing that show. for sure. Yeah, Anna well, Dermas, another, she's another oh, one. I'm yeah. going to watch it just because she's in it. Like that's oh, yeah. all it is. A hundred percent, all on board. All right, so that's that's what we got coming yeah, I gotta up. Wind next down. Episode. I'm gonna need a I know. Go more relax of these before the relax. night is over. Let's we'll see. Up, I'm excited. Open up a hey, couple of liqueurs. What I do gotta say though is, dude, comment on the video. Like, if there's something you yeah. horribly disagree, you disagree with. Disagree with? Comment. Like, let say, us know, like, dude. This is why you're wrong. This is why I agree. Diego with went you. on this a pretty good rant. Dude, I'm, I'm <laughs> and I have I have buddies that too. You're let me tell you why you're wrong, dude. That's why a lot of this film stuff and the fandom of Marvel or whatever is fun. Right? Yeah, you, have you get one to talk about that, it. Like, dude, this it is, loves it. Whatever, and this person hates it. Dude, comment, let us know. I would love Send to me chat a about nasty it. message. Like, let's go. I'm all like, <laughs> or if you agree with me or don't, I just I want to hear what you think. Definitely, but any, but either way, like, subscribe, uh, check us out. We're on all the social medias. Hit us up. Let send us, us messages. I want to know what everybody Comment. thinks. Comment. Thank you all for watching. That's the biggest thing. That's for sure. Later. Later. Later.